we go. We're getting up to this mark here is 40 centimeters of pressure in this steel drum. Actually, vacuum. 40 centimeters of water of vacuum. And that noise is our, the bottom of it being sucked in. So we made our maximum pressure okay. Next one is two times. That'll be 80. 120, 160. I'll have to see if my little uh, vacuum pump will do it. Should be able to do it. It's only, uh, what is that? That was either the, I think that was the back going. Same story. Tailpiece here gets sucked in. Normally it's normally it's pushed out. It's convex and it gets sucked in this concave, makes a big racket. And now we'll be testing the drum itself. So I'm going to step back in case this thing collapses. This will make it be spectacular. Okay, we passed 80 centimeters of water. Seems that the uh, asphalt seam sealer I put on the joint over here is working out really nice. We're approaching 100 centimeters. This is 80, that's 120, and we're just hitting 100 right now. Okay. And it's still climbing. I was just checking for leaks. Put your hand near them, you'll hear it very, very slow now. This is 120 centimeters. This is 100, so we're about 115 or so. And we're hitting 120 centimeters. Pretty quick. So far everything looks good. There doesn't seem to be any distortion in the drum whatsoever. This is our zero reference. 40 centimeters, 80 centimeters, 120 centimeters. This will be our 160 centimeters. So we're doing really good. This thing is still rising extremely slowly. And the drum has maintained its integrity. Uh, some of the things I was worried about, it does have dents on it. I wanted to get uh, an example of a real uh, drum that you just pick up. It's been uh, refurbished, so it's clean inside. There are a few dents on it. I'm trying to see if I can see one. Like here, there's a dent here, and there's a, a few other ones that, that I don't see. It must be on the bottom. 
There's a dent here. So they are used drums. It's increasing very, very, very slowly. What do they say? The old tune is it's like watching paint dry. You can see how this one is. I don't know if you can see it in the picture. This is really concaved in here. There's a little pump I'm using, vacuum pump. This hose has lots of kinks in it. Still increasing. So this is 120, 22, 24, 26, 28, 130. This will be 160. These two drums were uh, spot welded together in four places, then soldered using pipe plumbing solder and a blowtorch. We're about 130 centimeters right now. Yep, still slowly climbing up there. So slow. I don't hear any leaks at all. No, I hear no leaks. I was worried that if there was a small leak that the vacuum pump would be fighting the small leak to get the pressure up there, but it seems to be good. There hasn't been any noise since the very first part where this gets sucked in. That and the other end. And that was right around uh, 40 centimeters. So now we're almost 100 centimeters above that. Around this area here, so this is zero. This is 40 centimeters. This is where the, uh, the lid and the bottom were sucked in, made a lot of noise. And now we're way the heck up here. This will be 140 centimeters up here. So we're almost there. We're almost 100 centimeters above our max. So far, so good. Looks really promising. The bottom will be cut out. This is the bottom. It would be cut out and we'll, uh, there'll be a bellows put in there. So it moving back and forth, we're not so worried about it. This end over here, this will be uh, the head end, so we'll cut out a, a spot for the person to put their head and there'll be a, a, a nice gasket around their head. So we're hitting 3.5 times the maximum working pressure right now and it's holding its shape. Still got a couple of centimeters to go, looks like about four, well maybe six. That'll be 140 centimeters. Our goal is 160 centimeters. I would think the weak spot would be the uh, where the two barrels join. Um, as I said, it's there's four spot wells that are holding it together, and then it's uh, using plumber solder to fill in the, in the rest of it. I was just feeling the drum. Just feels cold, that's all. What do we got here? So, 120, 2, 4, 6, 8, 130, 2, 4, 6, 8, 140, 2, 4, 6, 8, 150, 2, 4, 6, 8, 160. So we're just at, right now we're at 140 centimeters. Success at 140 centimeters, that's three and a half times uh, our maximum for normal operating, or normal operating is 40 centimeters. We're at three and a half times. Very slow, slowly going up. Yep, still going up. Just gets slower and slower as we get closer to the top. 120, 2, 4, 6, 8. 132, 4, 6, 8, 140, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. That'll be 150 is here, so we've got 1, 2, 3, 6 more centimeters to go. That'll be 150.
Yeah, it's climbing out of crawl. Ooh, this is quite hot. That little pump is quite hot. That was my, I think it was a $40 Chinese special pump off of eBay or Amazon, one of the two. I don't know if my little pump will be able to do it. Yeah, it's really hot. I don't think I'll get to 150 with this thing. I'll stop the test at 150, which is uh, two centimeters from now. Because that's about it for my pump. I don't think my pump will make it to 160. That line, the small line, is 150. That's about as far as I'm going to take it. Doesn't look like my pump will be able to get to 160 without burning up. And it's working pretty hard. It'll be interesting to see if I close the valve to this, if it'll, uh, how long it'll keep the pressure for the vacuum. We're about one centimeter away from 150. Yeah, my pump's starting to spew. Oil, it's leaking oil now. Quite hot. And here we go. This is almost at 150 here. That's 150 right there. Hundred and fifty centimeters of water. Still structurally sound. Even with the dents in, in this thing. So I'll shut this down. So shut off. And we can see that there must be a leak in the system. It's dropping pretty good. So I think that's what my pump was uh I don't hear anything. 